Hi, I'm Bill Myers. This is another one of my video tips for the week. In this week's video tip, I'm going to show you how to create much smaller file sizes when you render out of Camtasia Studio and you render to the Flash format. I'll show you what I mean. This is my typical Camtasia production. You notice that I have a video uh, track here. And you can see on the screen that there's my video track, there's my audio track. I have some zooms in here and I also have a second audio track, which is a background track. This production is about two minutes long. When I rendered it uh, using the default SWF settings, which is the flash settings, it gave me a file size of 11.4 megabytes. That's a fairly large file. Not too bad, but it's larger than I want it to be. There is a way to render it so it comes out half that size without losing much quality. I'll show you how to do that. In Camtasia Studio, click File, and then Produce Video As, and then select Custom Productions, and then select uh, SWF FLV, that's your flash, and then click next. And under flash, I usually use the express show, and then select flash options. Under flash options, under colors, you can reduce the colors down, but to really get a much smaller file size, change your frame rate from automatic and reduce it down to about five. Unless you have a lot of activity, five will make no difference on the quality when the video is being displayed. I also use JPEG compression, and then I compress the WS SWF when it's completed. On the audio, I use ADPCM and the audio attributes are 22.05 kilohertz. And the reason I use this is that some MP3 files will, will have the chipmunk or squirrely sound on older flash players. And once I have these two things, I click apply and then OK. When I render this, I give it a file name and we'll give this a, just a different file name so you can see the different file size and click finish. Now that the rendering is finished, we can see that the render size, just by reducing the frame rate, has, has down to 6.15 megabytes. So we've reduced the file size by almost half. And if you view the video, you'll see that the video itself, the quality is almost identical, and that's assuming there's not a lot of motion. It's almost identical to the first video quality. So that's how easy it is to quickly get your file size down to manageable with a quick load and look great. I'm Bill Myers. This has been another one of my video tips. To find more like this, visit www.bmyers.com.